everyone. I'm Krista Casciano. I'm Jeff Kulikowski. State police continue to tell us, including today again, they have no indication any gun was fired at the state fair this weekend. But News Channel 9's Jeremy Skiba says that isn't necessarily calming all fears, especially with people who were there that night when the chaos broke out. Cell phone video captures frightening moments for these fair goers running for the exits after they believe they heard gunshots during Sunday night's Rick Ross concert. I don't think it's surprising at all that in a, a very alarming and stressful situation like that, you see people uh, conforming to one another's behavior. Psychology professor Adam Fay says he's seen different incidents similar to Sunday nights in the past. To him, it was no surprise to see concert goers reacting to each other. In the moment, what happens is that we look to other people to try and figure out what is an appropriate way to behave in an unfamiliar situation. This is the area of Suburban Park where concert goers started fleeing from. Faye says that due to the large crowds, concert goers started feeling panicked because those around them were scared. We assume that other people are uh, acting from a place of information or accuracy and so we conform our behavior to what other people are doing because we assume that if so many other people are behaving in a consistent way that they must know what what is the correct thing to do. In an email sent to News Channel 9 on Tuesday, state police say they are still investigating and there are no updates. At the state fairgrounds, Jeremy Skiba, News Channel 9. If you do have any information about what may have happened on Sunday, you're urged to call state troopers at 315-366-6000.